Okay, Assalamualaikum warahmatullahi wabarakatuh. Good morning everyone. I am Raikhan Pambudi as the Prime Minister. Well, as the Prime Minister, I agree with the motion that say that this house believes that the practice of meme investings bring more harm than good. Well, panels, nowadays, in this digitalization era, there are many of technology used by other people, by people and by citizens, especially around the world, to do something. For example, to editing features and many applications, and also there are memes. Well, guys, let me discuss about what is meme. Meme is an idea, behavior, or style that spreads by means of imitation from person to person within a culture and often carries symbolic meaning representing a particular phenomenon or theme. And then investment. What does investment mean? Investment is the activity or placing capital in the form of money or other valuable assets into an object, institution, or party with the hope that the investor will get benefit for a certain time. And then what is good? Good is a positive impact of something. For example, when we are study hard, we will get a good score, we will get a better score than the others. And when we study hard, we, study hard, we, we will be a smart people. And then the next example is like when we are saving money, we will be a rich person or maybe we, we will be a wealth people. And then bad. Bad is a negative impact of something. For example, just like when we are robbing something for other people, other citizens, we will be a prisoners. And then when we are doing an illegal street racing, maybe we will get an accident. We will get many injury and we have to go to the hospital, right? It is a bad impact for doing something bad. Well guys, now let's talk about the status quo. In this era, there are many people use meme and making meme to making money to get much money from other people, from uh, many people around the world using internet, right? And there are many bad impacts from this because men usually are often take from other people's picture and then they give or adding some captions about that that maybe it is just a hoax or something false. And then it will get many of bad impact from this. First, let me tell you that someone that used memes to another people, people without consent, it will getting bullied or being introvert. For example, there is a data say that Hey Die, he is a model from Thailand and then he is getting bullied because there are a meme say that he is, uh, he was taking a plastic surgery and then they have making an advertisement about plastic surgery with a base face for the children of HDA. And it makes it make HDA being bullied by people and broke their confidence, his confidence, I mean. And then the other is Firender Jubal. He is getting bullied because there is a meme you, a man said that Firender Jubal is a terrorist and then he got bullied by people and getting a hoax information that he is a terrorist but it's not true. And then the other is Alex Bromley. Alex Bromley getting a sexualization victim because of the meme use of other people to his picture, to her picture I mean. And then the others is Ghislaine Raza. Ghislaine Raza is bullied by his friends and also in, their, in his environment 
they get bullied by people because of meme made by other people on the internet well guys and the other impact that we can know from this meme is one people think that everything can be a joke when someone like to watch or to read a meme they think that everything can be a joke by them just to be just to entertain them to be more joyful in life and then people who is addictive to a meme will not getting a product productive time to do something good in their life for example just like when we are addictive to something and we are uh, just scrolling the memes all over over and over and then the others is making people disrespectful because of the memes they think that everything can be a joke and it means that they can be a disrespectful to other people but it's not right because people that addictive to a meme they will get a joyful joyful life that makes them being disrespectful and then the other is often satirize other people because they have many of memes that they looked or they read before it makes uh, them to save all the memes and then satirize people by uploading in the internet maybe on the uh, instagram or whatsapp or maybe line for example just to satirize other people just satirize uh, their friends or their family and it was so disrespectful for our people especially as an indonesian well because of that we have to know that memes getting many of bad impact many of harm than a good impact for our environment and that's why we have to know which is one is an appropriate meme and which is one is not because uh, we 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 not say that there are no memes that is have a good impact for our people because there are many memes that that is motivate motivate other people to do something right to do something good in a certain time so that's why we have to know which is an appropriate or inappropriate and because of that there are many of people have to rethink because before they before they read the memes or they influence other people with the memes they made and they have to rethink again before they make a captions because before they take other people picture and then give or adding a hoax caption a false caption about the people they they use about the picture and then after that they can motivate others by their memes and it's okay when they are uh, taking money from a right memes not an inappropriate memes okay guys that's all the data that i collected before and before we continue to the government web we are very proud to propose. Thank you.